Hello there, peace folks and dudes. Welcome back to Look How I Do Things. And as you can see, this is a little bit of the Anthem demo that they've been hyping up over this past weekend. Now, I recorded this, I think it was either Friday or early Saturday. This is me really just going around all the controls and looking at what was there to kind of look at. I didn't do the whole thing, the whole tutorial, demo, whatever you want to say. By the time I finally figured out how to get into the grit of the action and playing the game, I felt it was a lot of fun, but it's a lot to take in at the same time, and I'm not trying to be rude or hypocritical or criticize too hard here. I mean, a lot of people are relating it to, like, Destiny mixed with Iron Man suits is the best way I can describe, which I can kind of see, you know, the likability of that, but... If you guys are really into the action, you don't want to see all these settings and all these characters and how the world looks there in the main hub, go ahead, just skip to 28. If not, go ahead, stick around for more of it. And you can kind of see, I mean, I think the graphics are great. It, it There is a part where you go to meet characters, different little things you have to do, and you get kind of close to them. And they just jerk their head randomly like, what are you doing? So I thought that was kind of funny, but I, I left it for you guys to decide to kind of look at what you guys want to do one way or another. I did not realize this loading screen took this long now that I'm actually re-watching this and recording this for you. This this was a long load. Do, do you see that bar moved across the screen? It, it's It's tiny. It is really tiny just for a demo, but... Regardless, you know, everyone has their own opinions. Everyone likes different things. I hope you enjoy, and I'll leave you guys to it. Bye!
The bar has a shipment of Fortuo brew. <laughs> it is a good day. Fort Tarsus really needs a proper library. I trust the contract went well. Hey, how'd your last job go? The comeback breathing, it went fine. <laughs> Straight truth there. Just got back myself. Damn Titan nearly took my arm off. Always something, huh? Owen stopped by. Wanted to make sure your records were in order. No worries, though. A Titan won't stop me from keeping this place organized. How'd you end up as our record keeper, anyway? You don't seem the desk type. Layers, buddy. We all got him. You want a well-placed shot or a well-kept ledger? Ask Lucky Jack. We all do our bit for the family, right? You sign up, you pull your weight. It's that simple. It's more than that. But, hey, however you want to paint it. The point is, we got each other's backs. It's not like we got anyone else in our corner. Not today, but we'll turn things around. That's the spirit right there. We need freelancers to bring in contracts, get the work done. The better the Enclave does, the better we all do, right? Well, I've got reports to update before I'm back out there. Striders to save, relics to silence, you know how it is. philosophy is pretty simple. If you can't grill it, it's not worth your trouble. A man's stomach needs standards. Hello, my name's Amal, and I'm your bartender. Freelancer. Nice to meet you. Did you recognize my voice when I said freelancer? Was I supposed to? Well, I was in season one of Dawn Guard, so I thought you might. Really? What was your character's name? Sentinel 2. Sentinel 1 got to open the gate, but I was always at his shoulder. Just in the first season? 
Yeah, in the second to the last episode of season one, I got killed by a scorpion. That's too bad. Yeah, but that's life, right? You gotta be tough if you wanna be an actor. Who knows? Maybe you'll get another shot. You're probably right. I don't think Dongard appreciated me. Hey, you're pretty smart. I could use your advice. Okay. So there's this lady that comes to the bar and I think she's attracted to me. What makes you think that? She said, and I quote, I'm super attracted to you. So what's the problem? First, she's married. Second, to an aggressive Lancer. And third, I am terrible at saying no. How do you think I should handle this? You need to clearly say no thank you and stay firm. Yeah, that makes sense. I just hate disappointing people, you know? Just keep it professional. If she doesn't let up, then ask your boss for help. Good thinking. Max knows how to deal with stuff. She sure does. You are a wise person. I'm not gonna forget this. If I ever get into a jam, I know who I'll come to for help. Great. I know how you feel. How bad is it? We'll have to wait and see. What have you been up to? You'll love it. Okay, it's called the Manifold. Well, technically I call it the Manifold. And it does what, exactly? For years, I'd heard of a type of shaper relic that was able to amplify and augment the qualities of other objects. Never encountered one, never knew anyone that had, but thanks to the Elysian Manuscript, I think I know where one is. Right here in Bastion. And you think it'll amplify and augment the power of my javelin? Precisely. Excited yet? Uh... Not to worry. Once we find the manifold get it working, you will be. Guaranteed. First, the manifold. Then, we boost your javelin. You silence the heart of rage, and boom! Everyone lives happily ever after. It's a little more complicated than that. Ah, details. I've sent all the particulars of the location to Faye. I can't wait. Just out for a walk? Nice day, huh?
Everybody's out for a walk. Catching in our contact from Corvus. Freelancer, I see you're not one for briefings. I like to learn on the go. Can't fault you there. Name Sev. Corvus has assigned me to counter scar activity around Fort Tarsus. Since when does Corvus care about scars? Since they started making acidic weapons to attack supply caravans. That's a good reason. I think this is where they're making the acid. Any idea how? I want you to find that out and put a stop to it. I'm detecting one, no, two Shaper relics nearby. Might be part of how the Scars are making these weapons. Worth checking. Found the relic. The scars have done something to it. 
It's gone volatile. For those of us who don't speak shape with us, bad, right? Obviously. Freelancer, you'll need to silence the relic.
as you can see peeps hooks and dudes that's where i got downed and got to critical failure and with those two big i don't know if you want to call them tanks or bosses i wasn't going to get up so hope you've enjoyed peeps hooks and dudes please remember to like share comment subscribe and enjoy stay awesome i'll see you later Bye bye